birth, Mary Tenney Gray. She was born June 19th, 1833 and died October 11th, 1904. Mary Davy Tenney was born in Brookdale, Pennsylvania on June 19th, 1833. She was the daughter of Reverend Ephraim B. Tenney and Harriet Lott. She received her education in her father's theological library, supplemented by a course of study in the Ingalls Seminary, New York. She graduated at Wyoming Seminary, Pennsylvania in 1853. She was a 19th century American editorial writer, clubwoman, philanthropist and suffragette from Pennsylvania who later became a resident of Kansas. She lived in Kansas City for more than 20 years and during that time was identified with almost every women's movement. She served on the editorial staff of several publications including the New York Times Teacher, the Leavenworth Home Record and the Kansas Farmer. Her paper on women and Kansas City's development was awarded the first prize in the competition held by the Women's Auxiliary to the Manufacturers Association of Kansas City, Missouri. Death Anne of Brandenburg, Duchess of Macclesburg. She was born the 1st of January 1507 and died the 19th of June 1567. Anne was the eldest daughter of the Elector Joachim I of Brandenburg from his marriage to Elizabeth of Denmark. She married Duke Albert VII of Macclesburg on the 17th of January 1524 in Berlin. She brought a dowry of 20,000 guilders into the marriage and in return received as her jointure the city and district of Lubes and the district of Kravitz. Together they had 10 children. After her husband's death in 1547, she took up residence at the Eldenburg in her widow seat of Lubes. Anne died in 1567, as stated in her will dated the 25th of March 1557, John Albert I had her buried in Schwerin Cathedral.
event. In 1850, Princess Louise of the Netherlands married Crown Prince Karl of Sweden, Norway. Princess Louise and Crown Prince Charles married in Stockholm on the 19th of June, 1850. After the wedding, her father-in-law, the King, took her on a tour through Sweden to introduce her to the new country. The relationship between Louise and Charles was not a happy one. The couple had dissimilar personalities. Louise was introverted, shy and with a preference for a simple life, while Charles was extroverted and had a love for parties and a hectic social life. Louise was reportedly unhappily in love with Charles, who found her unattractive and was unfaithful to her, it was said with a different woman each night, only visiting his wife's bed once every three months. This pained Louise considerably. Louise bore two children, Princess Louise in 1851 and Prince Carl in 1852. Due to complications that arose at the birth of her second child, Carl Oscar, Louise wasn't able to bear any more children. Now Charles had an excuse not to see his wife, except for state occasions. In 1870, Queen Louise visited the Netherlands to be present at the deathbed of her mother. Upon her return, Charles fell sick and she nursed him day and night. Exhausted, she contracted pneumonia and died on the 30th of March, 1871. In 1872, Charles had controversial plans to enter a non-Moganatic marriage with the Polish Countess Maria Krasinska, but he died on the 18th of September before the wedding could take place. A Morganatic marriage, sometimes called a left-handed marriage, is a marriage between two people of an equal social rank, which in the context of royalty prevents the passage of the husband's titles and privileges to the wife and any children born of that marriage. 